Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today's problem is male calico cats could be the results of and you have to choose one of these answers. And on this picture you see calico cat and this is not a breed, this is just a pattern of the fur, which consists of base white color, black and orange. In calico cat's gene pool we can find two alleles, which specify black color and orange color. And these two alleles reside on the X chromosomes. So for example, female who has two X chromosomes can be of the following genotypes, can be with a B, B, or B, O, or O, O genotype. Of course, B, B would lead to the black color of the cat, or white and black, because white is a base color. B, O means black and orange, so exactly what we see here. And if female cat has two O alleles, then cat is going to be white and orange. As for the males, males has one X chromosome and one Y chromosome. For males, there is only two variants where the male would inherit one X chromosome with B allele on it and Y chromosome or O allele on the X chromosome and another sex chromosome is going to be Y chromosome. So cats, uh, male cats can be of the two basically color with the white and black or white and orange or completely black, completely orange. As you see in males, we cannot see this genotype, which is black, orange and white base. So if we are told that a male cat belong to this genotype, that means that this cat, male cat has two X chromosomes and Y chromosome. And this is result of non-disjunction and it can be with, uh, on the father side. So this male cat can get instead of just Y chromosome, both X and Y chromosome from the father side, or it can happen on the mother side. So from the mother side, due to non-disjunction, this male cat can get two X chromosomes and one Y chromosome from the father side. But anyway, what caused this specific color with patches of black, orange and white. White, as I said, is a base color, but why we see patches? Because in the uh, early stage of the development of the embryo in each cell, we would see both X chromosomes active. And if, for example, female cat has two X chromosomes with different alleles, then in each cell we will see both active B allele and O allele. B allele and O allele, B and O here, B and O here, and B and O here and here. But later one of the X chromosome would be deactivated and would form a bar body. And this is a random process. For example, in this cell, B allele would be inactivated or, or X chromosome with B allele in this cell, another X chromosome with O allele on it. Here, B allele, O allele here. So it is random process. And later on, each cell would divide due to mitosis and in each cell only that X chromosome with O allele on it would be active and another X chromosome would be deactivated. So later this cell would lead to the many, many cells because each this cell also would divide and this would lead to patch of the orange. And for example, this cell also would divide and lead to a patch of the black pigment of the fur. So as you see, now we can choose the correct answer and the correct answer is going to be answer B, non-disjunction leading to the male calica having two X chromosomes. This is rare event in males. So whenever you see a cat, which has this pattern of the coloration of the fur, 
we know that this is female cat. But if you will find that this is male cat, you instantly know that this cat has extra X chromosome. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. And see you in the next video. Goodbye.